Hi, in this episode, I will show you how to use the content plugin of Event Gallery. We do this in the front end. Just edit an article and add the content plugin tag. There's a special tag and the syntax you can check in the manual. Hit save and what this tag is doing, it shows you simple the name of the event. But that's too complicated, right? So let's edit this article again and use the buttons, which are more convenient. Just select the event there. And let's say we want to show just three images with a special layout. Then we insert the tag into the article and hit the save button. And as a result, we see three images. But maybe we want to have more images. The light box right now shows three images. So what should we do? We can edit the article again and add another tag. We use the convenient button again, select the event. And since we want to show more than three images and we already showed the first three images, we set the offset to three. And we set the mode to render hidden images. The result is that they are obviously rendered hidden. And if you click on them, you see that there are now eight images in the light box. So you can have a preview of the images and show the rest in the light box. The Event Gallery Content Plugin has a lot of more options, which you can see in the manual. Sometimes you want to add just one image instead of a bunch of them. So there is another button with which you can do that. Just click the Event Gallery Image button, select the event you want to use, select the image, and then you have a lot of options which you can use to configure the content tag. In that case, just show the image in the light box. Click on insert tag and that's it. If you now hit the save button of the article, you will see that there is this image appearing. And if you click on it, you will see it in the light box. So let's add another image which links to the event. We use the button again and start selecting the image we want to use. So now let's make this thumbnail a little bit larger. And now we use another mode, it's the link mode. So we insert the tag, hit the save button. Now we can click on that image and we are on the event page and see all the images which are inside. Thanks for watching.